My name is Mo Abubakra, and I'm going to read the poem, Ida's Light. This poem was inspired by Ida Mann, who was the first female professor in a medical or a scientific discipline in the UK when she was appointed as a professor of ophthalmology at Oxford University. In 1921, she introduced to the UK the slit lamp, which has revolutionized the way we manage eye diseases. This poem is also a homage to the generations of ophthalmologists and the profoundly poetic language they used when describing eye conditions of their patients. Ida's light in memory of Ida Mann. This lamp handed down by Ida slits the dark. This torch I hold at the keyhole unlocks mysteries. With its sabre light it invades the dark room where tree branches are crimson and the ivory trunk a glistening nerve, where carpets are reflexing red with a central cerulean lake shimmering. A gleam in the eye uncovers flies, lattice, tobacco dust, discerns the classic from the occult, a yolk from a bull's eye, spider webs from a map of North Carolina, detects holes, tears, rings, cotton wool, blood, dots, blots, fluid, frost and flames. This detective reports to me in clear view, in haze, in fog, hears bird shots, smells bushfires, plays with snowballs, devours honeycombs, tracks snails, cattle and birds, runs in a horseshoe, walks on a paving stone, swims with salmon in sea fans, finds fingerprints, in shifting Sahara sand. My trusted side click moves spotlights in caves and alleys tracing sight thieves to steer away from the tunnels, avert the storms and hold up the curtains. My storyteller speaks of hot tales, cold memories, images preserved, new addresses and old windows. Out of the shadows, the lost messages appear. Come closer, look here.